Good morning from Pollock Shields. And there you can see the glow of the sun emerging behind the flats there. <coughs> it is a gorgeous, gorgeous morning. I hope that uh, it is a nice day today as I'm dancing outside uh, this afternoon for four hours. <laughs> So, yeah, I'm back in the cage today. Back in the cage today. <laughs> and I'm sure not to do not climb on the framework. I was not climbing on the framework. Or do not hang on the ring. Do not climb on the fencing. <laughs> um, so, yeah, what a gorgeous day. What a lovely thing. Oh, it's so difficult when I come out on mornings like this because I just want to go for it like forever, um, but I have to pace myself because I've got a nursery workshop this morning. So I'm gonna be having very high energy for about two hours this morning with the wee ones. And then uh, this afternoon, I'm, I'm over in the Cathedral Precinct dancing outside um, St. Mungo's Museum of Art and Religious Life. It's actually the Museum of Peace has, uh, has commissioned me as a dancer today and, and for a couple other days as well. So I'm going to be dancing, doing random acts of dancing there for four hours. <laughs> Maybe a puddle by the end of this day. Um, so it's, it is really good. Like even like I said yesterday, it's really good just to come out for five minutes and be in the fresh air and just sort of connect. And it's amazing because um, in this park in particular, loads of birds, loads and loads. And when I'm dancing, I'm not saying it's because of me, but it happens when I'm here. They make these wonderful circles that seem to go in synchronicity with what I'm doing, which happened when I was here with Angus and Norman and their dancers months ago as well, which just, I don't know, it really, when you connect to nature that way and something like that happens, it's just kind of, you find it, or I find it completely uplifting. That's really, there they go, there they go. Hey. I don't know if I'm getting it. There you go. Yeah. So they've been doing that all around my dancing for the past 20 minutes, which is really cool. And they make these circles and then they come back, which is awesome. And, um, and today I was dancing as, as a dance of thanks, actually, um, because um, the past a few days in particular, and I think it's really good to do that now and now and again, is that we, we, we there is that element of in in um, sorry I'm still waking up. <laughs> when I um, have done sweat lodges, for example, um, and you go in and the first thing you that's in four sections and the first thing you do is you uh, you call in the ancestors, I think. So you you ask for guidance from the great spirits, you know, um, of of your past. Um, it is that, that great energy, which I think is, is a really lovely thing as well, remembering your, your heritage and what has come before. And there's also an element of giving thanks. Um, well, the, then you ask for yourself, then you ask for others, and then you, you give thanks as the, as the final section, which I think is a really lovely thing. So today, I, I'm kind of, I do it separately. <laughs> kind of, kind of, kind of not. It's not, as, as most areas of my life, it's not so concrete but I just was giving thanks for the wonderful yesterday International Women's Day event at the tramway. It was just magnificent. It was magnificent. It was such an extraordinary mix of art and heart, which I think ultimately, you know, uh, what did Van Gogh say? He said, the most artistic thing you can do is to love. And I do believe that. And so there was just this wonderful thing of women feeding their babies next to you know, experimental performance art crawl, somebody crawling down the way next to Asian ladies getting henna and it and all this wonderful knitting around and there is a real sense of camaraderie within the context of that. And it's this thing of, of giving everybody a <coughs> common purpose. And as as you're probably aware, I'm very anti anti I'm I'm not anti latest because I think you can't be it's not good to be anti anything, but I struggle with pretension and I struggle with elitism and because I think that's a closed door and and I think mastery can exist quite happily um, mastery of anything can exist quite happily with something that's getting started as that's where it, it 
this heart that began from and there's, there's a great amount of humility within the context of, of that. So that was a lovely, lovely day yesterday of, of sharing and, and celebrating uh, and I really, really enjoyed it. So I was, I was giving thanks for that. There we go again. <laughs> so I was giving thanks for that um, this morning in this dance and, uh, and for all the folks who helped to make my own process possible because um, I am not a one-woman machine. I, I, nothing I do is, is, is possible with uh, other people's support from, you know, my flatmate buying milk <laughs> to, um, you know, just words of encouragement um, to people to say, you know, you know all right, how, how's it going? And, and I think that's worth remembering as well. So I was giving thanks for all of that and the wonderful energies of Jetson and Jansen, Jude and Ruth, who put together an ex exceptional International Women's Day event yesterday. Long may it continue. So um, I'm off to do my busy day. Got uh, lots of dancing ahead of me. I'll be a puddle <laughs> by this evening. And I'll be back on the Brumalaw tomorrow morning. If all goes according to plan. So have a great day and I'll see you soon. Hopefully the weather continues. Bye.